Hey everybody, welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to show you how to propagate herbs. And this method can be used with other types of herbs such as mint, basil, today we're doing rosemary, and you can also do this with peppers as well. So before we start, let me show you some of the results that I've done so far. This is my pepper clone, and I propagate this the exact same way that I'm going to show you in a few minutes and as you can see there these are roots after the plant rooted you can throw it into the ground uh, in your pots or if you have a hydroponic system like I the one I made here this is very simple you can grow it that way as well here is uh, some basil so this is a a piece of basil that I saved when I had noodle soup at a Vietnamese restaurant I use that to propagate and this is what it looks like today. Initially it's it's very small about this size. So again today we're using rosemary. The method is very simple. It's it's a very fun experiment uh, in in very little time you're going to have a tons and tons of herbs that you may not know what to do with and at the same time this method is cost effective and also you're saving the environment by recycling your bottles and you can use any type of bottles you like these are just Ozarka drinking bottle this is a Mountain Dew bottle and basically this is what it's gonna look like so what you do is you cut the bottle right beneath the label so just use a scissor or anything you have And there you are. This is what you have. Then you just fill this up with water, tap water, nothing special. If you have a way to get these rosemary branches, I got these from a friend's house. He had a really large bush, so I asked to cut a piece off. Uh, actually, I didn't even cut it, I just tear it off right there. And from this, I'm going to use this branch to propagate two trees. So you can just simply cut this in half. Doesn't matter how you cut it. And what you want to do is you want to strip everything from the bottom here. Because this part is going to go in the water. And what I always like to do is I cut the bottom branch at a 45 degree angle. Just about so. And then you kind of like want to score this a little bit just like that not much and then just dip that in water and that's pretty much it so we're going to do this one as well just tear this out and when you tear this off, these bottom piece off the scoring process has already been done for you so you don't need to do anything else So there we are. And let's cut this at an angle. Just a little bit. Like that. Now, if you have rooting hormone, you can use that as well. If you don't have it, it's fine. It's still going to work. So since I have it, let's do a test. We'll do this one without and this one with the rooting hormone. So we're just going to apply a tiny bit into the water. very little amount and let's stir this up and there we have it and now we'll just take this piece place it in there and as I mentioned you don't need the rooting hormone just water in this container is sufficient now, you want to leave this by the window where this can get plenty of lights. Um, I have artificial lights indoor, so that's, what I, that's where I'm going to leave it. Probably in a week or so, they will start to root. But if you notice that if there are algae growing, change the water out. And if there's no algae, it's fine, just leave it. And when the water becomes dirty, just, just switch it out. But anyway, uh, I'll keep the progress going 
and I'll let you see what happens when the plants start to root. And today is October 23rd. I'll log the date and see how many days it takes for this entire this thing to root entirely. All right, that's all for now. All right, here it is, six days later, and the branch has started to form some roots. So if you leave it here for a few more days, the root will form much longer, and that's when you can transfer that into your hydroponic system, or you can just put it into soil, and this branch will grow into a new tree. So as you can see, propagating herbs is very easy. You can try this with other herbs as well. I hope you enjoy the video. If you have any questions or comments, be sure to leave it below and thank you for watching.